Hello, welcome to Soft Reviewed. Today we are going to discuss about a ChatGPT plugin that will help you save our prompts. Uh, whenever we need that, we can just click on a button and the prompt will be there. So we can, we just need to type in our requirement, then it will be processed. For that, we'll be using a plugin. It, this plugin is available both in Chrome and for Firefox. So uh, just install the plugin and, and just click on it. Then it will take you to this page where we can add our prompts and save it. You can also delete it by using that button. You can also see some curated prompt templates that uh, this plugin offers. Just click on next and it will uh, show the other prompts that's available within this. So as you can see, a lot of uh, prompts are available for different use cases. You can browse through it and see which one fits your needs uh, for this example we'll be uh, using a prompt for social media marketing mm, that's something that's very useful uh, for us especially so i believe most of the people watching this video will be having will be able to use this as well uh, so just uh, selecting it will uh, come up with this section where you can edit uh, the prompt and save the heading so uh, this default prompt i want to make some uh, changes i need to add pinterest there and i also want facebook post then i just don't want to post on youtube i just need uh, linkedin so this is my specific use case where i want to generate a social media post uh, for all these platform all at once so i'll be editing this and i'm giving some specific instructions uh, so that uh, my prompt looks really good and i also need like a clear call to action where i'll be adding a link to all my posts so and i also need an emoji wherever applicable so this is just a generic post and this will t save time if you are planning to post on different social medias uh, with the same content so uh, i'll also remove that insert section and i'll give a space in between so that it will be easy for me just click on that play button and it will um, take that prompt and will insert into chat gpt like as you see and here it will be visible so now you can access that uh, social media influencer prompt that we created oh i forgot to save it just click on it and it will save now the changes made will be reflected there okay and now as you can see now the changes made can be seen there and uh, that prompt is ready to be used and so for this i am just showing an example i'll take a URL link from my videos and I'll just take the title just to show you how easy it is and just click on enter and it will come up with um, the social media post for different social media platforms all in a single prompt as you can see it's typing in, uh, in for Instagram, Pinterest, Facebook, Twitter and it's also adding that url and giving emojis so that's pretty neat check the instagram post it did not include the url there because it knows instagram will not take url in their posts this also has different themes this is the terminal theme and this is the hacker one and sms type theme that's what it is called then they have like landscape sky cycle and you also have cozy fireplace so these are some of the templates i don't want any template i just like the way it is so you also have options to actually share this uh, via link it will look like this and you can use that if you want if you want to share this to someone you can just copy this link and give it or else you have another option to uh, share it as uh, a pdf file and that will be downloaded to your computer and it will look something like this so there there is also that option if you want then you have the option to actually share it using a 
and that's the .md file i believe it's just a small text file if you want it like that yes as you can these are some text that you can just copy and paste to somewhere you like so these are like some of the additional options uh, that we get for sharing you also have that png option where you just take a screenshot of that and displays it so that's the overall functionality of this plugin and if you click on the plugin again uh, uh, you have this to categorize it in different categories you ha there have like a lot of categories you can check that out you have uh, curated prompts where it's already pre-built and you have that public prompts where it will take you to their uh, reddit uh, discussion browse through these new prompts and that's been created and if you like any prompt just click on one prompt and that's like a mid journey prompt generator if you don't know what mid journey is mid journey is like an image generation engine where you give some prompts and it generate uh, images using ai so just um, to use this click save click on save and just try this prompt it will actually take that prompt from reddit and bring it here just to show you i'm not ex actually using it uh, so that's an option if you want it so you just need to give the prompt there and then it will generate a mid journey prompt if you want and another option we have is like this is where you see all your prompts you can actually delete it or edit it if you want and that's the basic settings of this so that's how it is the best part is that you can easily search your prompts later on by keywords and tags and you'll never lose track of great ideas or uh, the prompts that you used once so if you want to take your chat gpt experience to the next level be sure to check this plugin it's available for free and it's easy to use and it will save you so much time and energy in the long run and thanks for watching uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more tech tips and tricks if you like this video be sure to hit that like button and share it with your friends and thank you